Today is Friday, February 22nd, 2019. Uh, I got a bunch of packages in the mail today, so we're gonna go ahead and see uh, what's inside. <laughs> I guess we'll uh, start uh, right here. Make sure I don't cut anything. So this is uh, another Captain America fodder figure, uh, which if you've seen any of my other videos lately, I've been picking these up for um, mainly for the boots when I use um, Speed Demon um, or Machine Man or a Daredevil figure that doesn't have uh, boots. Um, unfortunately, the hands aren't really usable. I mean, the left one is not really the right because it has that closed fist option, which I don't really like. Um, this is actually a really nice figure. It's, it's pretty well detailed. I like that he's got a bunch of gear on him. Um, nothing really that I could use on the projects I'm doing right now. Um, that said, I tend to hold on to stuff for future projects. Again, don't want to cut anything. So this is what they call a butt pack on a one sixth figure. And I am going to use it as a backpack on a 112th figure, which actually works out really well. This I'm going to use for um, my 112 scale Duke figure. I wanted a backpack for him. Um, so I got rid of the one that was plastic. Um, I'm just going to have to stuff this a little more to give it a little bit of width. And then um, this will get attached to uh, Duke. I'm probably going to do... Um, double straps over the arms where the original one it kind of like hooked onto his bandolier um, which I don't really like so I think this is gonna look really cool it's actually sized you can see like quite perfectly for this scale figure so that's that's that Well, this uh, actually is a birthday present for my wife. She wanted a certain type of perfume. Um, so my daughter got it for her. And um, that obviously is not really part of this haul. So we're going to put that somewhere. Luckily, she's not home right now to see it. So that kind of worked out. Another cap. I'm kind of glad that, and actually I don't think it even showed it in the auction, that it comes with the alternate head. Because I am thinking about using this alternate head for uh, Leon Kennedy. So in that case I would shave it down and then add the hair. Um, it kind of has that simple uh, Leon look. Um, I don't know how else to describe that. He doesn't really have a lot of characteristics. So that, that might work. I'm going to check that out. And this figure, um, I would use by itself. Um, I used it on so many of them. Uh, I used it on my Cobra Troopers. Um, what else did I do recently? Um, I don't remember now. But somebody else, too, that I did recently. Oh, the Leon Kennedy figure. Um, so that would be actually kind of ironic because I'm using the entire figure then. Let's look at another figure. And it is. You know, it's it's kind of interesting too. There's just three different Captain Americas. Again, another great figure um, to use on its own. In this case, I would uh, take in the legs a little bit to make them thinner. Otherwise, um, the rest of it's pretty much just good to go. You can. Again, if you take this down, um, you could put some soft goods right over it and use them as is. 
And he, if I remember, yeah, he has a working holster. So this is something I would just cut off and um, use on him. Really, really nice. So out of these three caps, uh, this probably would be my overall choice. Like I said, his legs just have to be thinned out a little bit. Um, may actually be the best looking out of the three too. That's, you know, strictly my opinion on it. Now we got another cap. So this is, again, uh, this is a fourth one, different one. Um, he's basically this figure with um, I don't know, it's actually different. But again, this this would be, oh, there he goes, really be a, a nice base figure to put soft goods on. Because both hands are usable, uh, the boots are really nice. This head is going to go for my Outback Custom. So really all I have to do is put a bandana on him, paint his hair red, and uh, that's it. i uh, pretty much uh, about 85% done with that Custom then with the addition of this head. Which I bought the figure without that in mind. And then when I saw the head with the beard, I'm like, a little bit of a repaint, and that would really work for me. So let's see the final package here. So this is a... One six scale um, side drop bags. Um, they're definitely too big for this, um, but I get three buckles out of it. Which, if you go to buy these buckles on their own, they get like they want like on eBay like five or six bucks a piece just for a buckle. So I paid six dollars for three. So that's actually a pretty good value there. Plus. I could use the strapping um, for a belt, you know, that type of thing. And I am working on a Dylan from Predators right now, so uh, this is definitely some stuff I could use. So, I don't know, those packages look like they contain so much more, but there it is. That's my Friday night haul. I hope everybody is gearing up for a great weekend. For me personally, I'm gearing up for another two days of work. Um, but that is life. Um, hope everybody enjoys and I will catch you later. Bye. Keep watching for the next video. Come back soon. Bye.